Customs are ready, space explorers between the lines in three, two, one, go. Qualification match number 76 is underway. Team 4784, the Red Alliance is quick out of the gates and they drop a cargo pod at the same time as their Blue Alliance counterparts. Team 378, the New Fane Circuit Stompers. It's pretty neck and neck in the early going. We'll see if this, team, this match stays closer if one alliance is able to pull away. Over on the near side for the Red Alliance, Beam Robotics, the team from Buffalo. They've got a hatch panel precariously on the end of their arm, but it's secure enough for them to get past the defender and head over toward the cargo ship, the very end of the Red Alliance cargo ship, where they try and line it up and look for a place to put it. 6870 lining up but it seems like it just falls onto the floor. Over on the Blue Alliance side, Team 4601, the Circuit Birds playing some defense. Looks like the referee is counting for perhaps some pinning. Not entirely sure what the count is. It appears that they have violated rule G10, which is overextending. During teleop, no robot may extend past its frame perimeter while operating beyond a cargo ship's line. And that's a foul for every certain number of seconds that that happens. So that is why the Red Alliance penalty points are racking up. The violation of G10. Over on the Blue Alliance side, Team 378 spins a cargo pod out of their possession because they're headed back for another one. 378 grabs it, the New Fane Circuit Stompers headed toward the cargo ship. They bump another piece of cargo out of their way as they drive there and place it successfully. Blue Alliance out to a very large lead as we head down toward the end game period. 30 seconds to go and Team 6870 Beam Robotics is already up on HAB level three for the Red Alliance. Their bumpers are up above the line and they're secured. On the Blue Alliance side, looks like 378, the Newfane Circuit Stompers trying to make their way up to level two. They tilt their robot back and they drive forward. They're there successfully. Beam Robotics seems to have fallen below just a little bit. They tilt themselves forward at the very last second. That looks like from my vantage point, it should count, but we'll have to see on the launch pad first. 54 to 39. The victory for Blue, 24 of their points came via Blue, or excuse me, Red Alliance penalties. Part of that was the G20 we already mentioned.